just say hello try out the new stream and I was just driving along and just stopped and just wanted to I was just praying to God you know about getting ready we need to be praying to God right now and saying God get us ready get us ready for the things that are coming upon the earth get us ready that we're ready to do the work that he wants us to do because we need to be fruitful in every good work we need to be good Christians that are always ready to give a reason for our hope in Jesus we need to be pressing into God and pressing into his word we can't be half-hearted when it comes to the word of God when it comes to being uh, you know shining your light so anyway I was just praying saying to God get oh Lord get us ready we we need to be ready Father God for the things that are coming on the earth be ready for this time because you know the Bible says that the end days you, there shall be perilous times you know perilous is certainly right um, and I just wanted to share that um, that we really need to just be praying to get ready so that was really all I wanted to say so can we I'll just say a quick prayer Father God, we pray for those who are watching, Lord, that, that they too, Lord, will get ready. Father, I pray in Jesus' mighty name that we and our families, Lord, that we'd all get ready for what you're doing, Lord God, in Jesus' name. And that, um, Lord Jesus, oh, thank you, Holy Spirit. I just pray, Lord, that we would get ready, Father God, that we would not miss what you're doing in the earth today that we would not miss out on the things that uh, we should be doing that you've you know that you've prepared for us to do um, so I'm a little distracted I gotta learn how to uh, live stream when people are all around me because I just parked and then people come up and park beside me I gotta get used to just ign ignoring people when I need to ignore them so I was a little bit distracted there sorry but back to it, um, we we really need to be praying. So Father, I just I just want to pray for for um, for those who are listening, who are watching, and for our my loved ones, Lord, that we would get ready, Father God, Lord, make us ready. You know that Jesus said, pray that you would be counted worthy to escape that which is coming on the whole earth to test the inhabitants of the earth. You just don't know, you know, this, these are just the most amazing times that we're in, um, you know, right now, just absolutely astounding, and we can't be lackadaisical about our walk with God, we need to be pressing into God, reading the Word of God, and reading the red letters, you know, I encourage you to, to read the red letters, the words of Jesus Christ, you know, Jesus is all through the Word, obviously, because Jesus is the Word. Um, but, you know, when he came and ministered on the earth and he revealed a lot of things, and you know what he said to his disciples, he says, uh, Unto you it has been given uh, to know the mysteries or the secrets of the kingdom of heaven. Um, you know, God reveals things to us as we uh, delve into his word the Holy Spirit reveals things to us so I really encourage you to read those red letters have red letter days every day where you read the Word of God read the words of Jesus Christ and look into the mirror uh, that is the Word of God and really assess yourself and say am I doing that you know is that is that what I'm doing Lord God show me David said search my heart search me uh, search my heart and see if there be any wicked thing in me you know, and we really need to be praying that, not just walking along life saying, you know, uh, well, you know, we're the, we're um, sons of Abraham, you know, you know, we're the uh, uh, seeds of Abraham, um, but because we believe, you know, sons of promise. Uh, but like John the Baptist said, you know, God can raise up even these stones to be sons of Abraham. He said, um, produce fruit that is consistent uh, or w that shows that you've repented of your sins produce the fruit you know faith without works is dead you can't just live a life uh, without works you actually 
you know, proving that you have faith, you will demonstrate that you have faith by works. Um, you're not saved by those works, but you will prove that you do have faith by doing works through Jesus Christ. So, um, I just encourage you really to press in and to seek in, seek God like you have never sought Him before. Because these indeed are perilous times. We don't know really what's going to happen. Um, but I... I, I pray and I hope um, that we all would be counted worthy to escape which is coming on the earth to test the inhabitants of the earth. I pray that you would seek God like you've never sought him before and the same for me and my loved ones and that we would work out our salvation with fear and trembling every single day. So I just want to encourage you today. Let's uh, just say this prayer quickly. Father, we ask in the name of Jesus that we would be counted worthy to escape which is coming upon the whole earth, to, to test the inhabitants of the earth. Make us ready, Lord, for your return. Father God, we pray that we would be good sons and daughters who work in the harvest and not shameful sons uh, that don't. Father, we want to work in the harvest. Help us to work in the harvest, Father God, we pray in Jesus' name. May God bless you and keep you. May God cause his face to shine on you. May he lift up his countenance upon you and give you peace in Jesus' name. God bless you.